I've absolutely had it. I'm so tired. Of course, as you love onion and sweet corn, we're on a home stretch. So we're gonna leave that for as long as possible because no one's gonna be seeing me. I just got a message, tricked you. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I am gonna be letting my best friend control my life for 24 hours. sure you're all gonna know who my best friend is my best friend is Sam we have been best friends now for around four years and we have wanted to do another collab for so long but in the current circumstances it is pretty impossible to go and see each other so we thought it would be a fun idea to text each other a bunch of different things to do for 24 hours so essentially controlling each other's lives I really miss her I really want to see her but obviously at the moment we can't so this is the next best thing so I hope you guys enjoy and let's just get started i have just woken up and i have just opened my to-do list for today and the first thing saf has asked me to do is you need to do a 30 minute workout and if you guys know me you know that i don't really work out i don't go to the gym and i don't think i've ever started my morning apart from once when i went for a run with saf with a morning workout i'm gonna change out of my pajamas and we are gonna do a little home workout despite the fact that i don't work out i actually have a really cute little sports workout workout bra it's like a mint green color so i popped this on i've got some leggings on and we're gonna give it a go i am honestly gonna give this workout my best shot like i'm gonna fully try my hardest to do every single move i'm not very flexible at all and i get really tired very easily but i'm gonna give it my best shot so i've got a 30 minute full body workout with no equipment up let's give it a go so bad i'm eight minutes in and i'm absolutely knackered my heart is beating i'm also just boiling hot i really need to start doing this more so my body gets used to it <laughs> no 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 Absolutely had it. I'm so tired. I filmed little clips of it and I did about 28 minutes in total. You know what though? I feel like I'm gonna feel better now throughout my whole day for doing a workout. Like I already feel more productive for getting up and putting on some workout clothes and actually just doing something instead of sitting in bed and sitting on my phone. The next one, and thank God it is, it is shower and get ready for the day, full skincare and everything. So I am gonna head into the bathroom. I'm gonna get out these clothes and I'm gonna get in the shower. I'm all out of the shower. I feel so much fresh and I am going to do my full skincare routine. I'm going to treat myself this morning. So I'm going to start off my skincare routine by using my Freo Luna Mini 3. I always start off my skincare routine by using this and a foaming cleanser. It just cleans my skin perfectly and my skin just feels super fresh after using it. And then once I've done that, I will just wipe the excess product off with a flannel and some warm water. And then for my face mask, I am actually going to be using the UFO 2 from Freo, which I mentioned in a couple of videos back and and honestly, I've been obsessed with it. First of all, can we talk about how cute the device is? Mine is pink and gold and it's just so small and it's cute and it matches my nails. So the UFO2 is basically a smart mask that combines skincare technology and mask formulas to give you a high level skincare experience within seconds. The reason I love this device so much as well is it actually has full spectrum LED light therapy in it. So it will give targeted photo facials to your skin. So your skin will get exactly the facial that it needs. I'm gonna begin by connecting my my device to the app. Here are all the different options and I have got this one here. So I'm just gonna press the button and hold it for five seconds to connect it to the app. As you can see, that was super quick and easy and I'm ready to use the device. These are the different masks that I have got. I have got the green tea purifying one and the Manuka honey revitalizing one. I think I'm actually gonna use the Manuka honey just because I love 
honey so much. Well, you just need to pop the little ring out of the device. Make sure it's flat on and then you just want to pop the ring back into place to make sure it doesn't move. And then press start. The app actually talks to you and it tells you what LED light it is using and oh my god it's actually heating up. It says it's using the T-Sonic pulsations and it's thermotherapy to ensure maximum absorption of mask essence while orange LED helps revitalize the skin for a radiant glow. Like I said, the mask I used was actually the Manuka Honey one, which is perfect for dry and dehydrated skin. Therefore, it actually soothed the dryness and softened and revived my skin whilst I was using it. That is my treatment complete. As it comes to a stop, it just slows down and makes your skin feel so nice. And to touch my skin, it, it's just smooth. Imagine just gliding across. That's what my skin's like. It literally turned a 20 minute mask routine into a 90 second treat. So I'm going to pop up a load of the different benefits of the mask on screen now. I'm now going to go put some makeup on this freshly, freshly cleaned face. Next up on the list, Safa said, for your makeup, add some fake freckles and do a glossy lip the opposite to what you usually do. And that is very true. I usually do a matte lip. I never really do freckles unless I'm taking photos. I'm not going to film on my makeup because I recently did a get ready with me that I would also so link down below but a foundation combination that i'm obsessed with when i'm pale because i'm kind of trying not to fake tan whilst i'm inside just to let my skin breathe for a little while is the dior forever skin glow and the huda beauty this one is obviously more for the color but this for the glow just wait and then just look at this coverage i have honestly been obsessed with this combination like my skin isn't awful anyway at the moment i just have scarring how incredible is that coverage and I i'll update you when i'm doing my freckles and my glossy lip makeup is done it is time to add some cute little freckles i think i'm gonna love this look i love freckles i wish i had some on my nose i'm just using the benefits cur brow to do this there we go they look super natural but how cute you can do whatever you want with your hair but you do always have your hair down dot 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 i do always have my hair down and i currently have my hair up but i kind of just want to have it down and straight so um sorry babe, i'm gonna have it down cute i am all ready for the day i've got my lip gloss on and i've just popped on some jeans and i've popped on a cute little top and next on the list is food thank god because I'm so hungry. It is time for lunch. Make sure you have something with egg as it is my favourite. I love egg, so I'm definitely not going to complain. I think I might make, if I have to have egg, I had scrambled egg yesterday, so I'm going to make fried egg with mushrooms and toast. Good lunch. Going to grab the mushrooms out of the fridge and then I'm also going to grab the eggs. Here is my lunch. I'm honestly baffled where the white of the egg went. How did it shrink that much? Saf also didn't tell me what drink she wanted me to have. So I just texted her and she said, water, you know, it's my fave. So obviously I'm gonna have a glass of water. I have been waiting for this moment the entire morning because the first thing I would normally do is eat. So this is the best thing ever. Also, just on another side note, I really miss Saf. I haven't seen her now since we went skiing and I'm probably not gonna see her for a while. How I have control my day make me really happy. Lunch is complete, it was so good. I have just been chilling for a bit and I just checked the list and the next thing on the list or my afternoon activity is I've got to go for a run. Like I was explaining this morning, the last time I went for a run was probably over a year ago, which I know is awful. I haven't gone for a run in ages. So today, you know, we're pushing the boat out. I've done a workout and now I'm about to do a run. So I'm going to put a jumper on as it's actually a bit of a cold day today. I'm going to put some leggings and some trainers on. Here is my running attire. I've got on this jumper, some leggings. I've just put my hair up in a scrunchie and I've got some trainers on. I'm just going to get a timer on my phone and I'm going to sell it for 15 minutes because in all honesty, don't think I'm going to be able to do long than 15 minutes. I'm in the park. I've just ran one lap around it and I'm having a little sit down. I'm actually not finding this as hard as I thought I was going to. I think I'm actually better at running than just doing a general workout in my room. It's just so nice to get out and it feels like the air on my face after being cramped inside for so long. Honestly, I might try and actually do another two laps. This is my current view. If you can, I would definitely recommend you go outside for a run or just some sort of exercise because it is amazing. <laughs> 
we're on a home stretch i am running down the last path all the way back to my house and honestly i'm gonna start doing running every day so thank you Saf, for getting me to do this and actually get out of the house because i feel so much better like so much better for doing it although the last little bit i am actually gonna walk because i really am quite out of breath now i'm back i'm back in my robe i'm so tired i was saying i wasn't finding it that hard and i wasn't when i was doing it but i'm already starting to ache a little bit from the workout i did this morning and i think that's literally going to top me off so the next thing on the list is to watch one of our favorite movies and that's gonna be pretty nice so i can now spend the afternoon downstairs watching the tv watch one of our favorite movies i don't know which one to watch yet i'm actually gonna watch beyonce's homecoming so it's not one of our favorite films but it's actually one of our favorite memories because me and Saf were lucky enough to actually go to coachella and watch this performance live we went to the second weekend so when she was wearing all the pink outfits i've just come upstairs after the film oh my god the things i would do to be able to dance like beyonce her energy and just the stamina she has like oh my god she that film was like two hours her performance was like an hour and a half long and she literally stopped for like five minutes throughout it is time to find my phone and we're going to see the next thing on the list of course as you love onion and sweet corn that's exactly what you're having for dinner a plate of it and only it. I know that I have a bag of onions downstairs and I think I have a tin of sweet corn. Here is my dinner. I've got a tub of sweet corn. I'm not going to have all of this though. And I've got my little onion on my chopping board that I'm going to cut up. And there is my dinner, my bowl of sweet corn and my onion that I'm now going to take upstairs and I'm going to tuck into. I love sweet corn. Boy, that was hot. Sweet corn really reminds me of KFC and how much I'm actually missing takeaways. And then the raw onion reminds me of my salad that I get from McDonald's. But okay, this is a homemade version of my takeaway. Red onion is probably one of the best things I've ever tried. Some people get my obsession and some people don't. If you get me, we're soulmates. The next part on the list is treat yourself, have a pamper and do some online shopping. I might just text her. Are you funding it? That's good actually because there's a couple of makeup bits that I really want to get and I'm down for a pamper night. I think it could be way worse. I'm, my body is really aching and after that there's only one more thing that I have to do so I've, I've made my way through this list today. I'm feeling pretty good. That was so quick. I just had in my whole entire room and now it's time to get in the bath. I'm in the bath and I'm actually loving life. Saf, thank you so much. You've given me such a bliss day. I am honestly just going to lay here for like an hour and do a pore strip. I'm going to wash all my makeup off. I was going to wash my hair, but that's just a bit of a chore with drying it. So we're going to leave that for as long as possible because no one's going to be seeing me. I'm a happy girl. I'm a very happy girl. Netflix is on. Don't know what I'm going to watch. I keep asking for new series. I've watched The Stranger, by the way. That was really good. I finished that now. So is it time to start safe? Maybe it's time to start safe. Guys, the online shopping is commencing and this is going to be slightly dangerous. I'm already in a queue on Boots website and now I want to get some really cute layering necklaces. And Saf always wears that jewellery. She has the nicest heart locket and she always wears really nice earrings and stuff. And I have a really nice bracelet and ring that Saf actually bought me and then we have our friendship ring. But I need some layering necklaces. So I'm going to go down Pretty Little Thing and see if I can find any cute ones and then... I will show you guys what I find and then I'm going to do a makeup shop. Makeup and skincare shop I'm feeling like doing. I found some cute ones. I found this gold padlock necklace which is a layering one and then I've also found this gold choker and I'm just thinking with like the pink top that I was wearing today. This is going to look so cute so I'm going to add these to my basket. My literal prayers have been answered. Saf, I just got a message trick to you you can order a pizza you have to have pineapple on it though i would never eat a pizza without pineapple i don't like pineapple on pizza let me know if you do down below but i'm not going to complain i will just order a pizza with pineapple with cheese might add onion oh my god the heavens have opened i'm still in the queue on boots but i'm gonna get pizza while i'm waiting and this is where she my best friend oh my god it actually looks really good don't even care that i don't like pineapple pizza hits different and there's one more thing on the list although i still am online shopping watch pretty woman mm. as we can't go to the musical yet this is the next best thing we actually had musical tickets to go and see pretty woman which i got saf as one of her christmas presents but it actually got cancelled because of all the theaters closing that's what i'm gonna do thank you saf for the best day i've absolutely loved it hasn't been really a mad change from my normal routine but i've just enjoyed having Sure down. Oh, she looked good. She looked real good. Yeah. Hoo -hoo. Guys, order yourself some pizza. Treat yourself. That is the end of the video. 
video i really hope you guys have enjoyed if you did please smash a huge thumbs up thank you so much to Ferrero for working with me on part of this video and also a huge 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 thank you to Saf for controlling my day and giving me such a nice day like i've loved it i love you all so much make sure to check out Saf's video as well and i will see you very soon for a brand new video Mwah. bye <laughs>